Come with me for a sneak peek of the new Johnny Walker Princess Street experience in Edinburgh before it opens to the public on the 6th of September. Guys, this is eight floors of scotch. It is wall to wall in whiskey. It's a multi-million pound fit out of a former department store in Edinburgh. Everything is separated into flavor camps here. So even if you're not sure what type of whiskey you like, you can take a test like this one here, find your unique flavor profile. Uh, I did a test and it came up with tropical, which is is quite uh, apt for me actually. You can even go and try one of these uh, aroma sticks. So see which one of these you like. I tried a tropical one and mm, actually pretty damn delicious. That's definitely my camp. And you get the opportunity to fill your own bottle of Johnny Walker as well. It's a unique blend to Prince's Street. Just be careful when you're filling your bottle, don't do it so fast as I did. And you don't want that bottle to spill over and you don't want to drop any of that lovely whiskey. So this particular one is the autumn blend full of notes of orchard fruits and baking spices. Uh, get, get to put your label on as well at that 20 degrees which is signature to Johnny Walker too um, while you're there don't forget to also grab a dram so these are the four corners whiskies from Johnny Walker this was the Isla blend I believe and it was absolutely delicious great for drunk shopping <laughs> Of course you need to go and take a tour while you're there so there are plenty to choose from and every single one is bringing the story of johnny walker and scotch whiskey to life i won't give too much away but it is wonderful the one i did was journey into flavor so you get three drinks as part of that for 25 pounds the first one you have is a highball and it's tailored to that unique flavor profile that you chose before so this glass is yellow uh, which is the tropical flavor profile for me uh, so that is i think johnny walker gold label that they've chosen uh, topped up with soda water and then you get to choose your garnish from this garnish table. Uh, please do it a bit more cleanly than I did just there. Uh, and I actually decided to chuck in a bit of dried orange tea because why not? It's my drink, it's my rules, do what I like. <laughs> Enjoy it. This room was wonderful. It's so beautiful. Just look at that ceiling, all of that map of Scotland with all of the foliage coming off it, beautiful. So here is where we find out how flavour is created through the production process, through this beautiful animation. I won't give too much away, but you learn a lot in this room when there's also a beautiful amount of theatre as well. Lots of aromas released. So, yes, you get two more drinks. So, we wander into a bar and uh, you can choose from here a dram or a highball uh, or even an old fashioned. I chose a creamy highball, tried a different flavour camp because why not? Let's just give it a go. No trip to Johnny Walker Princess Street would be complete without a visit to the rooftop bar. Guys, just come for this alone. Go and grab a cocktail, grab a dram, and just check out these views across Edinburgh. They're not to be beaten. There's this wonderful, uh, beautiful view of the